go. But you 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 have to realize that uh, like it's it's okay. It's okay. I know. <laughs> So you want to tell people out there, the viewers, of what we're doing out here? No, it's just a one-on-one -on -one conversation. Okay. I, I'm just not uh, in tune with... Uh, yeah, because I have a big audience that likes to watch. Really? Uh-huh. <laughs> I've been doing this for a while. I get up to like... I've had up to like 23,000 people watching. Wow. And uh, the people that are watching, I'd say about 99% of them are on our side. And this is our way of getting out the, the word of what we're doing everywhere. And that uh, to remind people in other places and other cities where they might not have as much of a support system as we have out here, and, you know. So I come out. Like, I try to do it every day, whenever I can. I teach out at City College. Nice. I teach out uh, live streaming, social media. Wow. Right? And I do it just a non-credit course right now. But, yeah. Uh, Are you I have teaching a, in the summer or in the fall? In the fall. And I, and I do workshops too. Um, just write down your uh, at uh, Freeman Sullivan. Um, write down your contact information yes, in the course that you were teaching, yeah. and like I would definitely get on board. Okay. Yeah. No problem. I'll make sure you get the info. Mm -hmm. Cool. Uh, welcome, I'll welcome, yeah, guys. I'll see you inside. All right, I'm not not going anywhere. I'll be here for a couple <laughs> hours. Hopefully. Yeah, welcome, welcome, everybody. This is your intrepid live streamer, Freeman Sullivan, and we're out here at uh, 685 Florida Street, 19th. Uh, believe it or not, I used to live right on this very spot back in the uh, late 80s. This used to be a rock and roll uh, studio, and uh, as you can see from the side of the building here, anyway, this place was built, and they didn't have any framing on the building, believe it or not, and we were all living there. And if there would have been one big earthquake, we all would have died. Woohoo. So. Uh, anyway. Ask Aziz. He's kind of the person. Yeah, though, probably. We want to Sorry, just clear like, out just the right first here. like two feet past the fence. Like, all right, so we're out doing a, a bit of garden in here. We got Mission uh, Mission Commons. Uh, let's check over here. We got for more information. It says Esperanza Gardens at gmail.com. E S P E R A N Z A Gardens D A R D E N S at gmail dot com, and uh, if you want more information, I believe that's uh, Ryan. He's somewhere around here, and uh, we're doing really good work here. Uh, a little bit of green in the middle of the urban urban lands. So we're just going to kind of kick back and watch the gardening and watch the. The uh, place takes shape. They're doing weeding and cleaning and all that other good stuff. Hi. Hello. Hello. Happy Mother's Day. Thank you. I, I, I called my mom <laughs> two times. She didn't answer. I'm trying to call my mom again. Call your good. mom. My mom's dead. Call me your mom if she's alive. Uh, I would. Well, I would have called her. She knows I'm thinking about her. A beautiful day out here once again in San Francisco. That's 70 degrees. Nice and sunny, at least until 4 o'clock. And then we usually get our fog that rolls in. But it's a beautiful day right now. If you're in the neighborhood, come down. We're here at 19th in Florida. That's accessible by the 27 Bryant Street or the 8X going down Potrero. So do join us. Uh, there'll be uh, food and celebration down here as well. It's good to see you. That's actually a whole story, right? And it's like, oh, and then it got turned into we got a lot of former occupiers down here. Yeah, exactly. I'm just taking it easy today. 
I didn't want to get out of bed. Uh, I was a little tired. And uh, I barely made it down here. I took uh, three cups of coffee and a cold shower. But I made it. I missed the Warriors game, so please do not tell me who wins. Because I want to watch it later on tonight. Oh, there's Pirate Mike showing up. <laughs> like I say, we have a lot of former occupiers, occupiers down here. And a lot of friendly people, so if you got some time and you're here in the area, do come out and join us. Doing some gardening work. Down here at Esperanza Gardens here at 19th in Florida. Sunday. So we're here at the entrance to Esperanza now. Um, I guess we'll just walk inside and start taking a look around the garden. So we're having a celebration here today. <laughs> Hi, baby. How are you? Fine. How about you? Good. Oh yeah, we do too. This is a sister project of Occupy the Farm. I go to their website, Occupy. TheFarm.com, and uh, you'll find information about other gardening projects here over in Albany and around the Bay Area, and uh, soon to be around the United States. There's about 20 people here and, uh, out here gardening. Kind of amazing that when I moved out, that tree wasn't there. Now look how tall it is.
We are going to have an event. Well, like kick off an event in three minutes. All right, I'll be Back over. Back of the the Wait, garden. Okay. Thank you. We are going to lead a, a, a meeting at the back of the garden. Okay. Cool. All right. Well, I'll be making my way back there. Get off your ass. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Like to kick off this event. Cool. Yeah. In three minutes. Ooh, this is fun to write. Three minutes. Just a second here. Let me take care of that. that way. Take care of my seat. Moving inside here, so. Thank you. Yeah, Cody and Freedom. Papilina. 
And I think that one chick, that hippie chick. Part of what? <laughs> I used to remember this neighborhood when it actually used to be cool to live around here. <laughs> some strawberries there so I don't want to kill those. Oh, oh. So who? How you doing there viewer? We're down here at 19th in Florida for uh, Mission Commons. People are down here doing a little work on this plot. They're getting ready to have a meeting. So that's what's happening. Thanks for watching. If you got anything you want to, questions you have to ask, just log on to the social stream and I'll be happy to answer any questions you might have about this event. I am here to serve. This morning, folks. Last uh, afternoon took a while for me to wake up. Three cups of coffee and a cold shower, and now I'm here. So if I'm not, I don't seem as talkative today as I usually am. You'll know the reason why. Just tired. Been burning the candle at both ends, writing software and live streaming, and uh, leaves little time for sleep. So the reason why we're waiting around here is that everybody is wants to have a meeting of some sort. So
Lots of occupiers here. Matter of fact, this kind of started out as an occupied project. So if you don't have both legs blown off, you're not getting shit. And the idea is what I've been doing is fighting my bike. And they raise bees here. There's a small garden. It's a little oasis in the middle of urban San Francisco. As you can see, we're surrounded by a bunch of buildings. And this actually used to be a building, and I actually used to live here. Right where that guy with the black hat is standing, up on the second floor. That was my third floor. And we had a place with a big skylight in it. It was pretty cool. But the building was not up to code, and hence the reason why the lot is empty. So that's what brought me down here more than anything else is the fact that I used to live here. Or else I'd be snoozing right now. There you go. Thank you for watching. Uh, we're going to have a meeting in a few minutes, so if you're interested in what's going on with this project, uh, if you need more information, uh, the email address is Esperanza Gardens, E S P E R A N Z A G A R D E N S, at gmail.com. Esperanza Gardens at gmail.com. Anyway, uh, for those of you who are just joining in, uh, we're at Esperanza, Esperanza Gardens, 19th in Florida in San Francisco. Uh, it's a community gardening project. Uh, they're reclaiming this space from the urban uh, wasteland. So, uh, made up of former occupiers. Um, that hipster cafe right there. Thank you for being here. This is 
Esperanza Gardens and it's been here for four years. Uh, actually, like exactly four years. We started the opening of it from cement and soot and, and trash and, and, and homelessness. And uh, we cleaned it up and we brought in mulch and we've been raking our own compost here. We've been growing medic this is a whole medicinal herb garden. We have about 20 different medicinal plants here. We have peppers here, mm -hmm. tomatoes, uh -huh. basil. There's about seven different fruit trees here that all produce like a lot of fruit. We got a cypress tree that was planted only four years ago. And um, yeah, thank you for being here today. We are making pizza. All the food here is free or give donation. And we have drinks that are for sale, so we'd be uh, appreciative that everyone contributes a little bit because we've been, we've brought this for everyone to be part of. So your contribu <coughs> contribution, just a little bit, helps a lot. If you have questions, the garden will need to be watered throughout the day. So if anyone wants to water, I can help them with that. Um, we'll have, uh, I think Ryan right here with the dreads, he's going to have a, work, a permaculture workshop in the front. I can show you later on where we can plant some more seedlings and we can clear a bed and do that. And also I would like to also dig up some of the plants and put them in pots and whoever wants to can take them home today or give them to their friends. So uh, if you have any questions about what's going on today, you can ask myself, Gabriel who's right here with the hat on. Gabriel's awesome. Hi, Gabriel. Everyone say, what's up, Gabriel? What's up, Gabriel? What's up, Gabriel? Oh! I didn't hear you guys say that. What's up, Gabriel? That's all right. What's up, Gabriel? What's up, Thank you. He's an amazing permaculture, landscape designer, ecologist, and he has so much information. So ask him about that. Because he has a lot of knowledge. Moffy here in the back with the short hair that she just cut. Um, <laughs> it's always good to cut your hair from now and then. Um, she is amazing artist. And she's been here from the beginning. And she lives in the neighborhood. I live in the neighborhood. We've been attending this garden for four years consistently, multiple times per week, keeping it open for different activities, community garden for high school kids, at risk youth, everything under the sun, throwing events here. So if you have any questions about what's going on, like what you should be doing if you want to be participating in some way, which can just be sitting and enjoying the space, please ask Moffy. Say, Moffy, what's up? What is up, Moffy? What is up, Moffy? Moffy, what's up? So, Moffy, Gabriel, and myself, thank you for being here. All right. There you have it, so folks. just a thought, if anyone is going to take plants, make sure they actually are going to make a, get a home for them, because if not, we can find homes. Do you have anything I can plant? Is there anything? Anything. There's some native plants right here that people are stepping on, by the way. 